Ever since Frozen hit the theaters, it's become impossible for us to let it go. The Disney movie swept everyone off their feet with its beautiful soundtrack, lovable characters, and magical storyline. And when its sequel Frozen 2 hit the theaters, fans were mesmerized. But is there a threequel in the works? Jonathan Groff has something to say about that. First up, Frozen 3 is a possibility. The first Frozen movie follows sisters Anna and Elsa, voiced by Kristen Bell and Idina Mendel. Their journey towards self-acceptance finding the meaning of true love and discovering the world around them, along with stunning and unique characters such as Olaf, Josh Gad, Kristoff, Jonathan Groff, and Sven, Disney fans of all ages were quick to recognize the movie's appeal. Since then, it has done nothing but draw attention to the animated movie industry. The actor who voiced Kristoff, the dreamy hunk that marries Prince Anna, sat down for an interview regarding his ongoing projects. When asked whether there's a possibility there will be a threequel to Frozen, he didn't deny it. While while he didn't confirm it either, he did mention there's a significant possibility that we will get to see the characters return. Why is this huge news? Last year, Groff's co-star Josh Gad, who voices snowman Olaf, previously said he feels a threequel in the franchise won't happen unless there's a great idea, because otherwise it would be unnecessary. However, he was quick to add that if such an idea was brought up, the cast agreed that all of them would participate in it. I trust this team with all my heart to believe that there will be no need unless they have a great idea, the actor commented. He added, but I also know that the second they have that idea, they'll be the first to say, let's do this. But now, no Frozen 3. So what do fans have to say? While some fans were excited to hear that there's a possibility of Frozen 3, some were skeptical. This is because of Josh Gad's previous comments, and Disney hasn't made any announcements. Some fans are worried that the rumors are nothing more than a bluff to get attention and that Jonathan Groff's words have been taken out of context. If Disney wanted to make the third and installment, wouldn't they have announced it by now? One fan commented on Reddit. Another said, I mean, he said there's a possibility as he's open to the idea. He didn't confirm it. Furthermore, it's up to Disney. Besides, they're too busy enjoying the success of Encanto to care. Ouch. While it's true that Encanto has stolen the hearts of Disney fans, that doesn't mean Elsa and Anna have been replaced. The Disney sisters are still loved all over the world, even today. Most fans of Frozen have been eagerly awaiting the return of Queen Anna and Elsa. In a single franchise, Disney introduced two stunningly developed princesses that captured the hearts of Disney fans of all ages. And to think it couldn't get any better, the music was just as fantastic. Since the films were released, no one has been able to escape Let It Go and Into the Unknown since the movie was released. However, it's been years since we've heard the news of whether we'll be getting a threequel, until recently. In fact, it's been hard to believe that the first movie came out eight years ago in 2013. Next, Disney is still creating Frozen merch. Some fans speculate that since Disney is still creating Frozen merch, the idea of another movie coming out shouldn't be tossed out of the window. From the Oscar-winning soundtracks, park shows, musicals, games, and apparel and accessories, Disney has been innovative and strategic in using the Frozen fandom to grow its business. Despite what most people believe, it's actually Queen Anna, the most popular character in the franchise. Over the years, Disney has released a myriad of merchandise that features Anna, including rolling luggage, boots, clothes, night gowns, bowls, plates, coffee mugs, and home decors. The film directors also released storybooks with diverse storylines, sound effects, original actor voices, and even a mini projector to make the experience as accurate as possible. Moreover, fans are hopeful that there was even a book released called A Sister More Like Me, which includes illustrations by Brittany Lee, the film's visual development artist. Did you know that you can watch a live-action version of the film when you visit Disneyland? This makes the experience even more real. Since Disney Disney hasn't stopped producing any merch, some fans believe that the entertainment conglomerate has something special in store for the franchise in the future. Frozen Shorts We might or might not be getting a Frozen 3, but that hasn't stopped Disney from releasing short animated films over the years. Does anyone remember Frozen Fever and Olaf's Frozen Adventure? Frozen Fever was simply adorable. Almost a year after the first movie event, Elsa decides to throw a birthday for her sister Anna. Unfortunately, mischief happens when Anna discovers that her sister constant sneezing has become a problem. Despite being severely sick with the flu, Elsa tries to throw the perfect party for her sister to make up that she has always had a horrible birthday. In Olaf's Frozen Adventure, it's the first holiday season after the castle gates are reopened. The sisters plan a surprise Christmas party for the people of Arendelle to celebrate this opportunity and the seasonal bell. Olaf, meanwhile, has a mission to find a holiday tradition for the sisters to share. The short animated films were also highly successful. There's a chance that if the creators
creators and producers of the franchise don't go for the threequel, they will continue with the short films. But are we complaining? Who doesn't want to see more of Elsa, Anna, and Olaf? The sisters also made a cameo in Ralph Breaks the Internet at the 2017 D23 Expo. Since Disney continues to use the characters, we can still dream, right? Finally, Jennifer Lee likes to take her time. One thing that has made fans hopeful for a threequel is that Jennifer Lee, the screenwriter for both films, likes to take her time when writing the storyline. It's probably because she wants to do justice to the franchise. Jokes aside, the screenwriter is known for being a perfectionist. Frozen 2 was released a couple of years after the first film. Frozen 1 came out in 2013, whereas its sequel came out in 2019. That's six years later. The short animated films came out in 2015 and 2017, so fans are hopeful that even if they don't get the threequel, they can hope for another short film. Jennifer Lee has time and time again said that she likes to take her time to develop the storyline in all of her projects. Since Frozen 1 became a global phenomenon, we're guessing Lee felt the pressure to make everything perfect in Frozen 2, which is precisely what happened. The film was flawless and won several awards. So Frozen 3 may be in the works, but Disney and Lee are hush-hush about it, so there aren't any spoilers. We will have to let it go this time and follow the creators into the unknown. Next, in other related news. Frozen 2 story director thinks it's too soon to start worrying about Frozen 3. While rumors are going around about fans getting a threequel to Frozen, the director for Frozen 2 says there are currently no plans for a third installment of the film. Both the movies drew an immediate and decisive response from fans worldwide. The idea that Disney princesses are more than capable of rescuing themselves without the need for Mr. Prince Charming is what made the franchise a global sensation. But all of that jazz does not indicate Disney has plans to create a third film. However, there is the recently released documentary Into the Unknown, Making Frozen 2, available on Disney+, Plus, which follows Mark Smith and his crew on their journey towards making the movie. The documentary is geared towards older fans who want to get into the nitty-gritty of the director's work process. Mark Smith has always been vocal about how he loves seeing people embrace the film's characters, and how fans of all ages can connect over their love for the characters. We have to say, Mark, please think about creating the third film. Massive Frozen 2 theory reveals Elsa's secret power. A Frozen 2 theory reveals that Elsa may have a secret power, which would mean she can influence much more than ice, becoming the storyline for Frozen 3. Let's break the ice and talk about the Easter eggs we might have missed in Frozen 2 that could lead to the third film. One fan theory suggests that Elsa has a secret power that makes her more powerful than she is. In Frozen 1, we see Elsa learning to accept her powers, and in the sequel, she explores new levels of her power she never knew she had. Elsa uses her ice powers to evoke memories from the water, allowing her to see her own and her parents' pasts. She learns that she is the fifth spirit of the Enchanted Forest. Some fans on Reddit suggest that because Elsa has power over memories, she has the power to control time. Well, whatever the case is, we're hoping Disney decides to give us good news. That's a wrap for this video. Who is your favorite Frozen character? Let us know in the comments below. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. See you in the next one!